Good afternoon, DGR Strong in the new studio 1.5. Welcome back, everybody. Can you hear me? It's a little bit of a miracle that I'm live right now. There's been a lot going on today. Hope you're doing well out there. Let us know where you're watching from around the world. That's right, DGR Strong, Stronger Together. Again, if you could let me know if you can hear me because... Um, and if it's too loud, let me know that as well. Actually, it looks like it's a little too loud here. Let me just drop that down a little bit. So I hope you're having a great day. Let me take that off the screen, get the global going up here. Oh my, my, what a day. Here we are. Can't, oh, it's just been busy. Have you guys had a busy day? Extra busy at the Demore household today. That's right. Oh, Cameron, you are first on the screen. Cameron McBride. There we go. Studio 1.5, 1.5. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get some names on the screen. Here you in Ireland says STM. Uh, there we go. Arturo is watching from Mexico City. Thanks for watching from Mexico City. I do appreciate I realize I'm going to have to adjust these titles again. Okay. Sound is pretty good. Okay. Let me just see. It's like, it's a miracle this has actually happened because I was, it's been a crazy day. And it's, I just, all I could say is like every day, right? Right, Cameron? Okay. Here we go. Eileen, what's going on, everybody? So today we're talking about some DGR logo design ideas okay oh man i realize like the lighting is a little crazy let me just drop that down we're just getting used to the studio 1.5 all right where are you watching from around the around the world john is watching from san antonio thank you john hello aron from alabama graham from breckenridge colorado graham just up the road Thank you, Graham, for tuning in. I do appreciate it. There we go. Tim is watching from Greeley. Thank you, Tim. Actually, we got quite a few viewers up in Greeley. Awesome, awesome. Jeff says, yes, volume is fine. All right, good to hear. Uh, Brian is watching from Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, man. And, of course, how was your run today? Okay, let me just jump in. I think I actually may have already missed from earlier today some oh man some people staying up late over in europe i know we're going live a little bit later right now uh but i may have already missed a channel member i do i do apologize if i missed somebody that became a member of the channel all right oh man so how was your run today and let's just see jeremy what's going on jeremy are you the Q's runner is this the same person let us know, Jeremy. Jeremy's a member of the channel over on Discord. Thank you. Uh, just let us know there, Jeremy. I would appreciate it. Okay, and yes, if you have any questions, certainly hop into the live stream chat on Discord. Okay, so real quick here, going to do my best to... Again, lots going on. It's just it just was a busy day. Like I just took that off the screen and I didn't even mean to. Um, I'll get some of your runs up on the up on the screen here in a minute, if that's cool with all of you. And I'm gonna do my best to see if it's going to allow me. This is like totally random, okay? Like I'm just I'm just going for it. I don't you know, this is why I need a I'm actually gonna say it today. This is why I need a producer. Oh, see, like that's not supposed to be there like that. All right, I'm going to make it smaller. So there is one logo design that has been submitted in the last week. So if you're new to the channel, just so you know, it's a daily running blog. Thanks for being here. Uh, we are in the process of trying to figure out the right logo for Demore Global Running for a lot of different reasons, which we will dive into here in a minute. Oh, yeah. And if you could, Hit that like button. Let the rest. This is actually a critical one to hit the like button. If all 71 people hit the like button, the reason because this is for, oh man, the channel has grown a lot. I'm just trying to communicate, trying to be raw and real in my training, in real life, you know, with family, um, and of course, running shoe reviews in the studio. But it's grown so, I'll just say kind of quickly. It's beyond me a little bit in the sense that I feel like I'm best at storytelling. I'm not best at graphic design. It's not my thing. 
Like I'm not a graphic designer. So um, the more folks, so it basically, if you could hit the like button, I would appreciate it just to let the rest of DGR know so they can come in on this conversation about what is the future of Demore Global Running? Uh, what is it going to look like in you know six months from now, 12 months from now, 18 months from now? And uh, we're going to talk about merch as well here in a minute. Okay, let me. T- I'm glad that worked actually, even though it's kind of rudimentary and it doesn't look. You know, it should be probably transparent in the background, but that is oh. Okay, okay, let's get some names on the screen. Here we go, David from Sweden. Hello, David. Jeff, he is saying, really like this dotted D design. Looks like a runner in action and reflects the D in DGR. Exactly. Steve is here. Steve is here. Steve, Steve, I sent you some pictures on Discord for the videography chat. Not sure if you saw that yet. Steve, thanks for being here. Okay, Robbie, hello from Ohio. Hello from Dominican Republic. Watching from a cross country meet. Ryan, you're the best. Does it get any better than that? High school cross country is the best. I'm telling you, I love high school cross. It's seriously my favorite sport in the world. I'm not even kidding, Ryan. So, okay, Ryan says, I am currently on my run right now. Hey, I'm all about multitasking and efficiency on this earth. Here we go. David says, rain this morning, running this uh, afternoon, perhaps. Yo, Hastings, Nebraska, uh, eight miles easy for Tim. That's a great run. Great job, Tim. About to head out for a one-hour run, says Donnie. Awesome, Donnie. Australia in, Australian in Timor for Adi. Okay, Q's runner checking in. Okay, very good. Uh, Dominic says, good morning, everybody. It's 22 a.m. here. Now, let's see, 22 a.m. Now, what time is that? <laughs> let's see. No, wait. Do you mean 12.22? Anyway, Dominic, thanks for tuning in. John is here from New York. So let me just emphasize here. Oh, man, Froman. Thank you, Froman. Very good. We'll be in New York City this weekend for the Central Park 18-mile marathon tune-up run. Froman, awesome, awesome. Okay. Like I just said, graphic design is not my thing. Um, even branding, okay? And I don't bring up branding in the sense that I feel like we need a brand, but more in the sense that there's a uh, a growing consensus, I'll say, amongst DGR around the world that we want to feel but also be united in different ways, whether it's on social media, whether it's in a racing singlet. And I'm going to say the racing singlet idea is probably the biggest oomph in the last 12 months where people really, really, really would love a racing singlet, you know, that has something on it that unites us all, okay? And that gets me very excited, whether it's in a, you know, a road race, a road marathon, or a trail race. Um, And I frankly even have ideas down the road Oh my goodness, and I just remember this. Group runs. You know what I mean? When I travel around the world and meet all of you for races or group runs in your individual city, like New York City, like Boston, like Berlin, like Manila, like Sydney, Australia, wherever you live around the world. Um, and actually, let's ask that. This is a this is critical. Oh, this is this is big. Oh, what interest level would you have in a monthly or quarterly or maybe even weekly, I don't know, DGR group run in your city? And I realize like some people live in the middle of nowhere, like I grew up, or if you live in like the middle of nowhere, Montana, or somewhere in Canada, or I don't know, somewhere where there's no people, I realize, but at least in, let's say, like, let's talk, focus a little bit more on like some bigger cities, you know, Nashville, uh, Rio de Janeiro, uh, you know, wherever you live in the world, what would be your interest level in a DGR group run once a month, once a quarter? Okay. Let me know in the chat. I would appreciate it. Okay, let's go, let's go. David says, butter my bread, singlets, and trucker hats. Exactly, David. Come on, let's butter it. I agree. I agree 100%. Uh-huh. 
Chill Playlist says, yes, love the United Singlet idea. Uh, noticeability says Ryan Marketing. Yep. Okay. Uh, Laura says just, okay, that's good. Mm-hmm. David's from the Bahamas. Okay, 1222. All right, so let me know, okay. John says you've got a good base of fans on Long Island. It's crazy. I mean, listen, and I realize, like, as I'm always saying, I'm the guy in front of the camera. I'm the guy talking. But I hope, I'm, I hope it's more than me. I hope. You know what I mean? I hope it's all of us. So, John, I appreciate that sentiment, but I want it to be bigger than us. Bigger, Sorry, bigger than me in the sense that we're supporting each other, inspiring each other to turn that doorknob every single day, okay? Um, let's see. Tim says, I'd, be, I'd run with DGR crew at least once a month in Knoxville, Tennessee. That's awesome. Tim, thank you, Tim. Brian says, that would be awesome. Uh, Chill Playlist says, 10 out of 10 interest. Good idea. Cincinnati is where it's at. Tyson is saying trucker hats, Tampa group run. Let's go. Let's go. Um, so obviously I would love to fly around the country, around the world, you know, going on group runs with all of you on a consistent basis, but I'm just one person. Therefore my note, my thought behind this whole branding and logo design idea is that you know, whether it's through the t-shirts, through a banner, through a flag, through trucker hats that uh, we do, we really are united and we're holding each other accountable. And I realize we're also at all different ability levels. All right. That's also, you know, it's important to remember. Uh, but I think, you know, I'm not just trying to talk to the elite runners or talk to the beginner runners. It's everybody out there that's trying to get better in this sport of running, or frankly, even just to get off the couch, right? You saw the vlog today with true love. We're just trying to get off the couch with true love in the sense that get back into running, start with walking, um, and it's happening. It's happening right now. Okay, Together We Run says, yes. Well, if your, your name is says Together We Run, I love that. Yes, for group runs in New York City at least monthly. Studio 1.5 is beautiful. Thank you so much. It's coming along. You know, I've got some details to work out, but thank you for being here. Uh, Ryan says St. Louis. See, it's like it's amazing, but um, we just got to get organized, okay? So let me put Clay, okay, this is actually really important. Clay says, my brother-in-law is a designer, so he could do the logo for you. He used to do design for Adidas. So there's 100 people watching. This is critical. If you're a graphic designer or you know somebody who's a graphic designer, I'm just going to say we've had some pretty good designs submitted. And I'm going to put a few on the screen here in the next minute or two. I'm going to do my best. Um, and listen, so about a week ago, remember guys, I asked on the vlog, uh, are, could you submit your logo design ideas? We are actively looking for logos right now, like looking, brainstorming, going back and forth. Right. I'm, we had, we had about 40 logos submitted. I'm going to put some of them on the screen. We're not going to make a decision tonight. And you might be asking, well, Seth, what do you want in the logo? That's, just, that's, that's the hard thing is that I'm not – that my brain struggles with that a little bit. I'm just you know being very transparent here. Obviously, the D is something to play with. Demore, the D. Global is another aspect to play with. In fact, this is one that was submitted that um, it's not going to be the one, but I feel like it's – it's interesting in the sense that so the person is going for the uh, turning the doorknob. So the D is the globe, and then like your that's a door. So the D is opening up. Can you see that there? Okay. So let me just. I know this is rudimentary, but I'm just going to stick that up there. Hopefully you can see that. Just to get a few more flowing, this person really went for it with a bunch of different things. Oh, my goodness. Again, bear with me here. So, you know, just a lot of different. Let me just take this globe down, okay? So you guys see that there? Uh, they were going really for the mountains. But, again, I don't – my gut is telling me that mountains are not going to be included in the vlog. But also what am I saying? Um, onward and upward a lot. 
okay? So this is another one submitted that it's just, you know, interesting ideas. I'll just put it that way. Uh, let's just, I'm going to keep them rolling, okay? This one's, you know, another one, okay? Kind of a flow, not bad, not bad. Kind of almost looks like a road uh, when I see that. And so certainly Demore, certain, sorry, the D, the globe, onward and upward, inspiration, speed in the sense that we're trying to, you know, I think a lot of us are aspiring to become faster runners. Okay, so I'm just going to keep, if it's cool with you, if you want me to stop, let me know. But I'm going to keep putting logos on just to kind of tease it out. All right. So is that, let me know in the chat if, if this is cool, what I'm doing here. Uh, these, I actually thought this, so also, oh yeah, I want to mention apps. I think we're going to have an app someday in addition to merchandise in a, in the sense of like a racing singlet. Okay. A trucker hat. All right. I think we'll have an app for training, for running shoe reviews, for group run meetups. Why not? Okay. Why not DGR? Okay, here we go. Uh, oh, whoa! So sorry, so sorry. I actually thought this. I thought this was interesting. I like. Oh, maybe it's the green that I like the most. Okay, I'm just gonna put that over there. All right, can you guys, you guys, you guys, picking up what I'm putting down? Um. So, oh yeah, my email. So if you have, if you have logo design ideas, my email is info at demoreglobalrunning.com. Info, I should probably put that in a title. Uh, let me just put it up here, sorry. Once, this is this is raw, and this I just love being raw and real, okay? Hopefully, hopefully, hold on. Oh boy, there it is. Info, gosh, <laughs> at demoreglobalrunning.com. I mean, this is gonna be on the website in case you're unfamiliar with the website. It's just below the email. So if you have, lo again, if you have logo design ideas, again, thank you for hitting that uh, like button. Let the rest of DGR know that we are live. Um, and I'm realizing I did not download the best design yet. And I, I hesitate to even show it to you because I actually told the guy to change a few things because I liked it quite a bit. Okay. So I'm actually going to download it right now off of my email. I do apologize. Just bear with, bear, bear, bear with your, bear, bear with your brother. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, where did he go? Mm. Oh, I'm so sorry. So sorry. So sorry. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh gosh. I cannot find it. It's, um, okay. I know it's somewhere. Um, you guys are the best. What do they say in radio? You never have silence in radio, right? Well, this is a moment, a moment of silence for the, okay, there we go, for the logo being pulled up. Okay, there it is. Okay, I see it there. Now, let me just open this up. Let me just open this up. Let me just open this up. Okay, and actually, I'm going to get your gut reaction here. Um, and I think he's okay with me showing this to you, uh, even though he's going to tweak it a little bit. But it is interesting. Now, you're probably going to think of, yeah, wow. It's really interesting. He gives some really good background. Okay, bear with me. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm going to stop talking here. Okay, hold on. Oh man, this is bad television, but I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. Now it's the suspense and, okay. So this one, there it is. Ready? Boom. So when you see it, to me, it speaks to speed. Now the D, basic. okay. What I see in it, immediately a couple people have commented they, well, so it's got that line through it, which I actually kind of like. And I think it could be lit up in a certain way at times. Um, it's got the onward and upward. Now, I realize it doesn't have – logo design is very difficult, just so you all are – it's like very, very difficult. But it, 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 it catch out of everything you're looking at on the screen, I would say this one, this one – 
catches my eye the most. Okay. Let me know your thoughts. All right. I'm, I'm, we're just, we're just going for it here. Okay. Okay. Right. Laura, it looks fast. That's what I thought. And I kind of like that now. Exactly. Brian, it does look a little bit like Gatorade that did come to, I actually didn't think of that. Somebody else commented and said, yeah, you know, it kind of, they thought of the Gatorade. What is it? A G and then there's like a lightning bolt inside the G for Gatorade. I'm not exactly sure. Um, but it's not bad. I gotta say, I gotta say it's not bad at all. Okay. So hype expression studio, um, you submit it demorg or info at demorglobalrunning.com. Okay. Email it over. And again, everyone, this is kind of a big deal in the sense of, um, trucker hats, singlets, app development, website design, social media, a banner like this is, it's kind of a big deal, but the reason we're even talking about this is because of all of you. All right. It's like, we're stronger together. We're inspiring each other. The discord community. Okay. Oh man. Sorry if I've missed any new members or super chats today, but, um, okay. So this is interesting, right? Isn't it exciting? Like it's actually happening. Not too bad. Uh, Jeff says, yes, lightning bolt in G for Gatorade. Okay, good. I couldn't remember exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and exactly, Brian. So that would definitely not be the colorway. Um, so it would not be, it would be probably green or white with a green accent or blue or anyway. I, so that's what he, Brian, that's what this gentleman is working on. Okay. This is fun. This is awesome. It's good. It also shows you didn't, you don't need the three letters think of. So, and you, it's kind of the G in there and as well, there's also a little bit of an R not sure if you can see the R it's the upper half, a lowercase R, but it's the upper half of the D. Okay. Right, Joe. I know. So let me just see if there's any others bear with me. I don't know if there's any others that are like really jumping out at me. Um, you know, well, I'll put that other one back on the screen. Sorry, Hugh. Sorry. It's just crazy. We're buttering it today. We are buttering it. You know, there's just so many opportunities with logo design. It dry. It's just, it's a little overwhelming. I did. I don't know what else to tell you. And then there's this one. And there was another one submitted that actually looked really similar to this one. Um, and I know I'm missing some. Again, there was over 40 designs submitted. 40. 40. And these are the ones I'll just say that jumped out at me. Okay. All right, that just jumped out at me. And I know I'm missing a couple. Okay. So if you submitted a logo design and you're like, wait a minute, where's mine? Who knows? 40 emails. It's a lot to manage. But all right, let's dive into the chat. Get you guys going here. Oh, uh, now I'm like scrunched scrunched in between the, uh, in between the logos, but, um, info at Demore global Um, okay. I'm going to keep going here. Let, like get your comments. Let's see. So BC, which one do you like better? Uh, if you could be a little more specific, that'd be great. Uh, Donnie says, I like the last one as well. The best, the DGR logo that is interconnected is interesting, but looks kind of corporate. Let's see the DGR logo that is interconnected. I'm not sure which what you mean. Maybe that one over there, Donnie. Maybe you could just be, there you go. Uh-huh. Brian says it's very adaptable for icons, hats, or singlets. And here's the deal. These logos can be tweaked to our heart's delight based on your sentiment, based on what you love, DGR. Okay, so that's the beauty of going live with all of you, going back and forth. I know we'll probably talk about it on Discord. We'll talk about it on the Facebook group. Uh, but I want to include you in the process. At the end of the day, I will make the final decision. You know, there's too many cooks in the kitchen, as the saying goes. But I love getting your insights and your thoughts. I mean, it's like, it's endless. Like, look at all. It's just awesome. I just love it all. I think they're all great. Um, oh, Tyson, you demand. Yes. Together we run. It looks, yep. Okay. Let's see. 
So Declan, De, Declan Black says, I totally rock a singlet and hat with a Gatorade-esque one. That's the crazy thing is that it it really does kind of jump out at you. You know what I mean? Uh, Mariella is saying the last one is my favorite. Mariella, I think you mean this one over here. Very good. Thank you, Mariella. Make the dot on the last one a globe. Yep. Uh, Greg, there was um, – yeah. And again, I wish I could pull up uh, – let me just make sure I'm not missing any. Yeah. There's one more, but it, uh, this is this one – Probably isn't gonna be the one, but it, yeah, I'll just, I'll put it on the screen just for just for fun, just to keep it zesty here. Um, yeah, you know. Oh my goodness! Again, options are endless. I'll make it a little smaller, kind of put it right there. All right. Uh huh. Brian says, "Haha, I will take any logo as long as it's on a quality singlet." Brian, I couldn't agree more. Uh huh. Doug says it's too reminiscent of Gatorade. Good. Doug, great feedback. And then, uh, Doug, we can um, we can talk about that. You know, we'll talk. Uh, I'll talk. You know, I think I'll, I'll bring it up with a designer. That's why we're here. That's why we're chit chatting. I love it, Doug. Thank you for the the feedback. Okay. Matt says latitude and longitude lines. Okay. The JCP006 says Seth needs to choose three finalists and then do a poll. There we go. There we go. I know, Matt. I'm I'm in that direction, Matt. The Gatorade one is hands down the best of the ones shown. Yep. And it's got potential, I think, to get even better, Matt. See, he, okay. One last point, and then um, I want to jump into maybe any more questions you might have. Look at – all right, let me just pull up, I guess, like this page. Um, well, what I'm, oh my goodness. Let me just see here. Okay. So what I'm going for again, I just, I'm, I must say I'm going for simplicity. All right. Simple, simple, simple. Pull up the phone, uh, pull up your phone. Okay. So there's my phone. All right. Some of the apps I have. Okay. There you go. There you go. See it just simple. Just think simple, okay? Simple. I know, like, logo design can get very complex very quickly. I like simple. Like, most of these, but not all, I could envision on an app. You know, we just boop, a little boop, all right? It's like just, I think simple is where I lean. I'll just say that much. That's why if you did submit a logo and you're not seeing it on the screen right now, it's because it was probably too complex for my liking. All right, so I would encourage you, like, flip through your phone, look at your apps. That's what I'm going for, all right? Even here, here's a logo design. Go Avs. This is the hockey team in Colorado. You know, this one's actually a little complex, but it's one thing, okay? Oh, you guys are awesome. Ian says the Gatorade-esque one is by far the best I would order my trucker and T-shirt today. Needs a bit of tweaking, but it is a solid start. Nice. Ian, how would you tweak it? I'm very curious because I think it's moving in the right direction as well. First of all, what am I always saying? Onward and upward. Uh, so that line, the line going through the D to me speaks to kind of like an onward and upward movement. There's obviously the D. The G is hidden inside just a little bit. And then there's the R, but it also looks fast. You know what I mean? It kind of looks fast. Mm, it's very interesting. Oh, thank you, Brian. This is very exciting. Thank you to everyone who's working on these logos. Um, Cameron says, I can see the Gatorade similarity, but it's different enough. And it's, uh, frankly, okay, I got to stop because I actually – can't quite exactly picture the Gatorade logo. Hold on. I I haven't looked at a Gatorade logo in a while. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is different. I mean, I see it. I, see, I for sure see this. Oh, wow. That's interesting. Very interesting. I just haven't looked at the Gatorade logo in a long – or can't like – I actually remember – I thought it would look even closer. Interesting. No, I think this is different. Actually, let me just – why not? 
because we're having fun today. We're just having a lot of good fun today. Hold on, hold on. One, two, three, buckle my shoe. Hopefully I don't get a copyright for this. <laughs> oh my goodness. I could, I, who knows, maybe Gatorade will come after me. Okay, here we go. So there's the Gatorade. Interesting. Interesting. This is great. See, I actually thought it would look even more similar. I didn't really, like the G is obviously very G. It's like that's a kind of an old school. I, I, I don't feel like it looks like, I mean, it does look like it, but I, I don't feel like it does at the same time. Um, mm -hmm -hmm. Eric, thanks for being here. I do appreciate it. Thanks for the comment. I would steer clear of any globe symbolism. It's too reminiscent of an IT company logo. Yeah, I know. You know, in Joe, isn't um, Discover card, right? Discover, the credit card. I think they have a globe or like a circle. I often think of Discover. It's tough. IBM? No, maybe not IBM. I know. It's hard. The globe is used a lot. I 100% agree. Okay. Mm -hmm. David, I'm not exactly sure what you're talking about. What about something like this with a bit of more of a running slash movement motif? Do you, are you talking about the Gatorade one? Maybe just let me know. Declan, best way to sort through logos is that it should be identifiable on a one inch by one inch scale. There you go. I like it. Hello from Adelaide, Australia. Okay, maybe the lines in the middle could look like a road, says Laura. Uh, do you 100% want the D, Clay? No. That's a good question. No. Doesn't have to have a D, okay? Does not have to. In fact, D. D. Here's the harder part. D uh, clay. Or sorry, yeah, Clay. Sorry. I, I love the story behind Nike, okay? I love the story behind Nike. Whoop, right there. Okay, in the sense that, all right, there's the Nike. Okay, we've got Andy's on there. E eBay, okay. So I love the Nike swoosh, how simple it is. And I will also say that we make the logo in the sense that we make the community. We make the DGR running family around the world. The logo does not. You guys know that. Like, over time, it could become identifiable because of you, not because of me, not because of, I, that's my approach, okay? But Clay, not 100% sold on the D, not 100%. Lean in that direction, perhaps, because it's simple, yeah, but not 100%. Good question, Clay. Um, mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. David says, I think if you soften some of the corners of the lightning bolt, it won't be as reminiscent of Gatorade. Thank you, David. Okay. There was a link I posted above, but not sure it went through. My bad. I'll email it to you. Thank you, David. Okay. Justin says, big fan of incorporating the Hoka shoe into the logo somehow. Major inspiration for the channel. Yes, I know. But then, so my thought there, Justin, is that that makes the logo look a little too complex. Also, I'm also saying, Justin, is that, um, there it is back there, is that um, it is a huge part of the channel, like just the, yeah, but... The channel, I think, is more than running shoe reviews. So, but Justin, I like this sentiment. And then Fernando, here we go. I think you need the three letters. The principles are the D and the R. It's also about your own running initiative for a running movement. Okay. I love you all. I have to stop. Mm -hmm -hmm. Let's see. Brian, not so literal. Reminds me of Roger Federer logo. Now, which one are you talking about there? Crazy enough. Um... Marcelo, yes, we have tried the doorknob. This one up here is kind of like a D opening, like that's the door. An actual doorknob, I know. It's like, oh, it's it's hard. It's hard, Marcelo. It's a, that's a good sentiment. Good sentiment. Okay, crazy enough, everyone. I'm actually going to close out with just a few questions. I wish I could go longer. It's almost, well, I gotta, we got to go up and make dinner here at the Demore household. Info at demoreglobalrunning.com if you would like to submit your ideas if and I, listen if you email me i might not email you back for three days a week two weeks i don't know 
if you already email, you already know, like it just takes me time to get through emails. So uh, thank you for your patience. Let graphic designers know, like, like that you know, uh, send them a link to this live stream. I think they might get a better sense of what we're looking for. Let me just take Gatorade off the screen though. Um, so it's a process, but guess what? You are part of the process, and that's what I love about it, all right? Info at demoreglobalrunning.com. This is it's gonna be big, everybody, and I know I'm not putting all of them up. Oh, okay, I can't resist. Stop, all right, don't go, don't go yet. Don't go yet, hold on, hold on. There was one other, and I'm, I gotta find it. Hold on, I'm so, I, again, today was kind of a crazy day, and so I just, oh my goodness, David is already sending in some more. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. This was one of them. This was one of them. Hmm. But am I going to have time? Yeah. See, I think that one is a little too, ah, why not? Uh, this is kind of a totally kind of simple. I don't even know what, I don't know. I got to find, I think he was going for like a trail marker look. Okay. A trail marker look, which is fine, but I think it might be a little too generic. Um, but it's not going to work, of course. So that's okay. All right. Now I am going to sign off one last chance. Come on. E can. There we go. There it is. Okay. Boom. All right. You know, eh, it's like movement onward and upward. Obviously it's the wrong colors right now, like to, to a certain extent. So that was one more that, you know, kind of simple. Maybe the arrows could be considered like a D, um, uh, pointing to the right or the left, depending on what screen you're looking at. So, all right, cheers. You guys are awesome. Keep turning the doorknob. We're going to get, <laughs> what's harder running the Pikes Peak marathon, racing the Pikes Peak marathon or logo design. You tell me, I know my answer. I definitely know my, it's right here, right? Everything floating around me. All right, everyone. Seek beauty work hard and love each other. Ah, we'll do this again, probably next week as more logo designs come in. We're drilling down. We're drilling down. It's like all about drilling down together. Okay. So we'll probably do this again. Stay tuned on the channel. DGGR strong. Oh man. DGGR strong. Here we go. Seek beauty, work hard, love each other, each other. 5am tomorrow. Ciao.